<laughs> this is what life looks like when when I'm just out of control and super busy and just trying to make things work. <laughs> like my room is disgustingly dirty. I didn't even want to clean anything up. I just wanted to show you guys the reality. Um, I'm leaving for Durban tomorrow, like I mentioned in the previous vlog. I think that vlog is coming out, I don't know. Um, that I'm leaving for Durban, so <clears throat> just trying to pack. But most importantly, I'm looking for my wig, you guys, and that's why. Well, actually, let me not lie, this is not why my room is so dirty, but it's part of the reason why my room is so dirty. So, I have this pixie wig, this one over here. This is the one I wore on presenter search, my Winnie Mandela wig, that's what Tawanda calls it. Um, but I have another one that was sent to me. And it's better quality, it's better everything. I can't find it. As you can see, I've already prepared my hair for the wig. So the wig must be found. It's not an option for the wig not to be found. The problem is, I don't know whether the wig is going to be found. So that's what we're going to try and do now. And then we're going to try and pack for Durban tomorrow. My flight is at... Oh, you can even see my... Oh, so dirty girl. <laughs> That is nasty. <laughs> My flight is at 3 o'clock, but I have to work in the morning. So I'm basically going to work in the morning, trying to finish as soon as I can, and then catching flights, not feelings. <laughs> and then I'm off to Durban. <sighs> okay, let's look for this wig, because it has to happen. And I keep my hair stuff down here. So... Usually my wig is like at a designated area, but I couldn't find it. So I'm hoping it's one of these plastic bags that has all my hair stuff. Otherwise, I am screwed. Okay, let's get looking. Okay, so I managed to find a wig. Um, this is a wig that was sent to me a couple of months ago. Um, as you can see, I haven't even cut off the lace. I've never worn it. I really don't want to experiment <laughs> and try and wear this wig for the first time ever, like, at this event. So I'm going to try and keep looking. Otherwise, we're going to have to try and cut this lace and make this wig work. Let me take off the net and show you guys what this wig looks like. So this is the wig. As you can see, it's a lot of hair, and then it's got like a lace front over here, and then I haven't cut the lace off because I've never worn it. Um, but I wanted this to be a whole video where I do like the unboxing of this wig, so I really hope I find my pixie wig. Otherwise, we're going to be in a lot of trouble. Literally, I have to be asleep in a couple of hours, but I still have editing to do, a whole lot of other work to do, so fingers crossed, fingers crossed. I keep looking at the screen. Fingers crossed. Wow. <clears throat> so I just spent the past hour looking for my wig and then i remembered that i last wore it at this race horsing event um it's on instagram and i was like um so i was wearing it with this hat so where could it be y'all i've never been so upset in my life it was basically waiting here for me so this is the wig that i'm gonna wear there is a huge difference between this one and this one. Um, I can't really tell you what it is, except when you see it on, then you'll know. So, yeah, I'm going to be wearing the new one, not the old one. And, yeah, I'm just going to continue now to clean my room because it's a mess. And then I still need to edit and I still need to do a whole lot of work. So, wish me luck. 
Oh yeah, I forgot to do the transition out. Wish me luck. All right, so <clears throat> I finished cleaning as much as I can. Well, except for this, I'm still eating this. <clears throat> and I'm so irritated by myself right now because I've just realized that I last saw my ID book a long time ago. And if you are foreign, then you know the struggle. Like for me to get another ID book is me having to prove my permanent residence, having to prove that I am indeed legal, which I am, and just going through a whole lot of stress for another ID book. <clears throat> so yeah, I am majorly irritated because I don't remember the last Okay, I do remember the last place that I saw my ID book. It was in this bag. And I told myself I should stop moving around with my ID book because I am going to lose it. And instead of putting it the same place where I always put my passport, I hid it. And every time I hide things, I have a hard time finding them. And that's exactly what's just happened right now. So, <clears throat> yeah, that's happening. But anyway, I can't stress over that right now. I know it's somewhere. I know I definitely didn't lose it. I know it's definitely not stolen. I just have no idea where it is. But for now, I'm going to go on ahead and pack a, a makeup bag. Because I've just realized tomorrow I might not have... I hope I'm not yelling with my ears in this bonnet. <clears throat> so, tomorrow I might not have enough time to do my makeup at home so i might have to pack like a mini makeup bag and then have to do my makeup at the airport like i've always i've always side-eyed people who do their makeup at the airport because i'm like uh, girl don't you your lights together but today i shall stop judging because <laughs> clearly sometimes you have other things that you need to do because I have to be at school to invigilate from 8.30 to 11.30. And then I, I want to buy a new dress for this cruise thing because I don't like the dress that I have right now. So I need to do that from like from 12 to maybe 1. And then from 1 o'clock to 2 o'clock, I basically have to take a shower, do a full face of makeup, change. Yeah, that doesn't sound like enough. So I might have to do my makeup at the airport. So I'm just going to pack my bag right now oh my goodness god is good i found my id in here in here i knew it i knew it i knew it i knew it i don't lose things i just misplace them and i put them in weird 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 hiding spots so <clears throat> should i just put this back here i think i should because i had it I had an inkling that it was here, so I think next time I look for it, I'm just gonna have to hide it here. But I found it because I was also looking for this spray. Um, it's a body mist, but I actually use it as a room spray because, well, I don't really use body mists. But if you ever find yourself needing a room spray that doesn't smell like, you know, um, what do you call this, air freshener, but still smells good, I would recommend this. Anyway, back to packing my makeup bag. First to go into the bag is the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation. It's going to be a really long day tomorrow, so I mean, you already know. Oopsie, jeez, Larina. My goodness, I need to take a nap. One of my favorite eyeliners of all time is the Revlon Color Stay um, eyeliner. And I love it because of the little tip that it has here. Tomorrow, I think I'm going to go with like a super simple um, cat eye and not do any foundation and i know that this baby right here is going to save lives and save time so it's definitely going with me my favorite eyebrow kit um i got this as a press release from essence like a while a while ago clearly um but i absolutely love this i love doing my brows with this powder here i actually prefer powders when my eyebrows are super groomed just because it's easier for me to work with them and then, of course, I'm also going to take a brown 
eyeliner to further help with my eyebrows i hope there's oh, there isn't even enough here i don't know i might just do them with powder tomorrow i don't know dude standard do i even need to explain no no i don't of course I love this eyeliner. It is literally a, an, an, an angel. Hey, angel. <laughs> an angel sent from above. Um, it's super easy to use. And I love the tip that it has because it allows you to declump your mascara. Like, look at that. Have you ever in your life seen such a brush? Uh, no, you ain't. I love it. It's definitely going with me into my emergency makeup bag. And then, of course, my favorite eyelash primer. Oh, jeez, that's dirty. Whatever. My favorite eyelash primer, which is the Lash Sensational from Maybelline. Definitely coming with me. Recently started using the Brow This Way uh, Brow Styling Gel by Rimmel London. I got this um, at the NMB Beauty Exhibit when I was emceeing for them. So I got like a little goodie bag to go home with so yeah this is definitely coming with me so it's just a clear gel that helps um set your eyebrows so that they're on fleek for as long as possible that's what it looks like nothing fancy but definitely knows how to get the job done darling <laughs> i'm going to be highlighting tomorrow with two highlighters so i have the Makeup Revolution Pearl Lights. Please focus. Thank you. Makeup Revolution Pearl Lights in Candy Glow. And then I'm also going to be highlighting with, um, well, it's not Vault, Vault Cosmetics anymore, but it's Jackie Guido um, Cosmetics. And yeah, those are the two highlighters that I'm going to be using. I don't know if I'm going to want to prime my face tomorrow, but if I do, this is what I'm going to be using. So it's definitely going into the emergency makeup bag. To set my face, I'm going to be using the MAC Studio Fi uh, hello? Um, work with me here. I mean, you're the new camera. You're supposed to be doing the things, okay? The MAC Studio Fix Powder in NC47. Just to set my face and make sure that it's matte all day. Though, when I'm using the Estee Lauder Double Wear, I don't really need it. But it's just a just in case. The Estee Lauder Double Wear is really good. If you haven't watched my review on that, then click over here or over here. I don't know. One of the two. When it comes to setting my concealer, I love using the Cryolin um, Translucent Powder. Some people find it to be a bit strong for certain skin types. But I absolutely love this stuff so I'll be using this to set my under eye and anyway that I put my concealer um okay yeah that's I think that's I think everything that's relevant mm, not necessarily relevant but like anything that's work worth speaking about on camera I think everything else is just like standard procedure so yeah it is currently let me see Oh my gosh, I shouldn't have checked. It's currently 9 o'clock. <clears throat> I still have videos to edit. I still have work to do. I still have my bag to pack. Um, and I still have to wake up early tomorrow so I can be at school really early. Mm -mm -mm. this thing called life but anyway i will do what i have to do hustle hard keep hustling hashtag we work in i saw that from fizz but you know i don't think he copyrighted it so hashtag we work in boo okay <laughs> oh my gosh i am so irritated because i'm supposed to actually be at work in like five hours but I can't sleep. Like you can see there are bags underneath my eyes. But my body is like, um, I think you've got so much to do tomorrow. Let's think about all this stuff that you're going to have to do tomorrow. Oh my gosh, you've got so much to do tomorrow. How are you going to handle it? So I'm out here unable to sleep. Um, I've tried to work. I've tried to do everything. It's just not working. I think I'm going to try and look for... <clears throat> um, what you call this? 
those sleeping what's the name sleep sleep what what sleep sleep videos on youtube <sighs> and see what happens let me just show you what i'm searching for um sleep what sleep excuse my screen sleep hypnosis for calming an overactive brain oh that sounds that sounds about right let's do that let's see what happens it's quite normal when we start to meditate for the mind to jump around she's just place. skip ad Do please listen to this recording whilst driving or whilst operating machine <laughs> <laughs> this guy's voice Best enjoyed with earphones. I'm trying to sleep. I'm not trying to listen to no damn music. You're not helping, sir. Hi, Michael. Michael, ain't nobody trying to listen to your voice, man. Like, just put me to sleep. Oh, let me listen to this one. I listen to this deep delta wave one all the time. It's pretty good. Let's try that. <sighs> yep. Let's try that and see if I'll be able to go to sleep. Otherwise, um... Hold up, hold up, hold up. Otherwise, it's very late for me because I have a lot to do tomorrow. Like I said already. So... Yeah. Good night.